Keegan, I'll let you take this question from Jeff. Are you still teaching split step load before first step for middles? Oh. Yeah, that's probably the only position that we're, we're teaching the split step to. We think they've got um, the most responsibility to go two directions. We think that that's a, a move that allows them to do that. Um, so yeah, it, it is something that we teach to our middles. Yep. And can you just explain briefly what that is? Yeah, again, split step is a little bit of a, um, I will uh, use the right terminology here, but um, you see it mostly in defense. You see it in uh, you see it in tennis quite frequently where they have to make a decision to defend the center of the of the court or the, or the sideline. And um, it's almost, uh, I don't know if deloading is the right word, but we're, our, our, our feet are getting wider uh, at a certain moment. Uh, you're engaging what's called the stretch shortening cycle. Again, this is where, like me as a layman, I start to lose myself in the conversation. <laughs> I'll give you a visual. Okay, you ready? And yeah, that was great. <laughs> and, uh, you know, a lot of athletes feel that it gives them an opportunity to um, get out of the box a little faster here. You know, and and the emphasis here is side to side. It's not going up. You know, um, in this split step situation, and so, you know, kind of getting our feet wider than shoulder width, and then also the rebounding effect of you know, moving right after that, a lot of athletes, uh, I wasn't in the middle, but they tell me they feel like they're able to get out of the box a little bit sooner. Yeah. And, um, this is just kind of a natural thing for athletes, right? Certainly I've stopped trying to coach it out of them. You know, we'll introduce it to some of them. If it's not there, if we think that their feet are really narrow or they're not really loaded to move, we'll talk about it as a concept that we teach. Um, but I think it shows up a lot of places on its own in a, in a lot of different sports.